Hey, this is Taylor from Elevate, and I want to welcome you to the BOD Wads 2. Here are your standards for Event 2. Event 2 has a six minute working time for maximum reps. Athletes will work through a chipper, followed by a maximum calorie row with the remaining time on the clock. Beginner's division will start with ring rows. Their body must be parallel to the ground and feet can be flat on the floor. Judges will be looking for full range of motion on the ring row, both on the way up and the way down. This will be followed by burpees to a plate. The athlete's chest and legs must touch the ground before getting up to the plate, showing full hip extension. The athlete's hands do not need to go over their head during the burpees. Beginners will return to the rings for another set of ring rows, followed by burpees to a plate, and so on until the reps are completed. Should the athlete finish the chipper under six minutes, they'll proceed to the rower for max calories with the remaining time. Each calorie counts as a rep towards their final score. The intermediate division will be using pull-ups rather than ring rows, and any style of pull-up is acceptable. Strict, kipping, or butterfly pull-ups will all be acceptable as long as the athlete's chin gets above the bar and their arms reach full extension at the bottom. The burpees to a plate will follow the same standard as all other divisions, where the chest and legs must touch the ground, the athlete will jump onto the plate and reach full hip extension, hands over the head do not matter. The athlete will continue going through the chipper until all reps are complete of the pull-ups and burpees. If time is remaining on the six minute clock, the athlete will finish on the rower again for max calories for a final score of total reps. The advanced division will complete a series of pull-ups followed by chest to bar, followed by bar muscle-ups for their workout. Just as in the intermediate division, any style of pull-up is acceptable as long as the chin gets over the plane of the bar and the arms reach full extension on the way down. After the pull-ups, the advanced athlete will go to burpees to a plate. This will be the same standards as the other divisions. The second set of pull-ups will be chest to bar, in which the athlete must make contact with the bar below the clavicle. Again, this will be followed by burpees to a plate. The final movement on the pull-up rig for advance will be bar muscle-ups, and they can be performed strict or kipping. However, the athlete's feet cannot go higher than the level of the bar on the way up to the muscle-up. Advanced Division will finish with their final set of burpees to plate, and any remaining time on the clock can be spent accumulating max calories on the rower.